friends, welcome back to my channel, Coffee with Stephanie. Um, so I went to Dollar Rambo today, and I got one big bag. Not just one big bag, but I got two big bags because Dollar Rambo saw me coming. So, <laughs> um, but we are going to do, we are going to do this haul uh, while I sip coffee. Hubby just brought me Tim Hortons coffee. Roll up the rim. Um, I miss the old days of roll up the rim when you could actually roll up the rim and see if you won. I really miss having a cup tell me to please play again, <laughs> you know, um, but now it's all digital, it's all through the app and everyone, I think every, every roll is a winner. So, so far we have won two free coffees, two free donuts, and a bunch of like um, rewards, you know, reward points for Tim's, five, point, five points, so yeah, but I do miss old days when you just rolled it up yourself. It's just not the same doing it on your phone, you know, going, oh yeah, you know, <laughs> that's not. <laughs> oh. oh, all right, that's good. Mm. All right, so this bag when she packed it it started to rip she noticed before i um left um that it was ripping and she put another bag yeah she gave me another bag and you know i had to help her kind of you know that's very hard it's very hard to put you know, a bag that's already full of stuff and it's awkwardly shaped into another bag yeah so yeah <laughs> okay and of course yeah my, i forgot my bags at home Woo, look at that baby uh-huh yeah don't worry what's on me coming uh, okay so let's just start um cinnamon raisin bagels 250. um they are not 250 at the grocery store so great deal because casey loves having bagels in his lunch and that's it. He has a bagel like and cream cheese. Not even toasted and he loves it. Me, on the other hand, I would want it toasted. Yeah. <laughs> but no, he eats it like that. So. Um. Alright. These are absolutely adorable. And they were only $1.75. Oh, I can't do it because that's <laughs> what <laughs> right hand you have to be right handed. So, you know, I wonder if they, but now that I'm thinking of it, I wonder if they had ones that were like on the other side. They're um, they're cups, uh, you put your hand through there. I thought that was so cool. Uh, boys would get a kick out of that dollar 75. But now I'm wondering, it's like, I wonder if they have ones for you know, if you're left handed, <laughs> you know, I'm not sure. Yeah, well, I thought they were just cute. They already have like a Halloween cup with like a straw on that. I think I got a Dollar Tree, but I just thought these were super cute. And green is Henry's favorite color, and blue is Casey's favorite color. So, yeah, dollar seventy-five. All right. And of course, I went there for uh, a couple of placemats to put um, in the middle of this table right here. Um, last year, and this is the only thing left that I have to do for fall decorating, then I can film my fall home tour, um, hopefully next week. Uh, but last year I did a tablecloth that I bought at Party City, and it's a beautiful tablecloth. Um, but this year I don't feel like always having to fix a tablecloth, because that's the only thing with a tablecloth, and having a table that's a magnet, and everything, you know, seems to find its way back to the table, even though it doesn't belong there, and, <laughs> and the only person who puts it back where it belongs, it's mom, mom, you know, uh, us moms, so it's like, you know, or, like, or the tablecloth will get, like, pushed, um, you know, off or halfway off, you know, and you have to fix it because if they're doing a craft. So, you know what, this year I'm just going to do it easy. I'm going to, I picked up two of the vinyl, um, placemats and the pumpkin. They were only $1.50 each, so I picked those up and I'll put, um, centerpiece in the middle. Because I just don't feel like, you know, doing the tablecloth, you know, fixing it all over again, and over and over and over again. Um, yeah. Coffee filters. Mm -hmm. $1.25. It's 
speaking of coffee, let's take a sip. Mm, okay. Um, and I kept forgetting to get these, and I almost forgot them again. Um, the burn, burner liners. So I picked one of the um, big ones and one of the small ones. And they're, yeah, each dollar fifty. You would think though these would be a dollar twenty-five. You know, because they're smaller. Yeah, but maybe because you get ten, so they charge. Yeah, that's probably it. that's probably it. Yeah, because you get ten, so they charge you a dollar fifty, and you get six, and they still charge dollar fifty. Yeah, yeah. They should just you know one should be cheaper. One should be a dollar twenty-five. Come on. <laughs> oh, okay. So speak. Bit. <laughs> um, sticking with Betty Crocker, I am going to just you know stick with Betty Crocker I have quite a few Betty Crocker items um, so I have I want to do chicken pot pie so I got the tins we have round foil containers with lids I was gonna get the other ones that were $1.25 and I think you got three in there but this one you you get two um, but you get the lid, which I think it's a lot better, you know, um, yeah, and plus I, I find these ones are like deeper, you know, they're deeper. So I picked up one, two, three all together, they're $1.50, right? Yeah, um, cause I might be doing shepherd's pie too, so that's why I got, um, three, cause I'm not sure how many I'm going to need. All right, like I said, sticking with Betty Crocker, um, vegetable peeler, $2.50. Um, I have the exact same one. I've had it probably since we were married. <laughs> Around that, yes, yeah, yeah, nine years, and it's just starting to go. Mm, excuse me. And uh, parchment paper, packed up a couple. I'm going to be doing a lot of baking, so $1.25. All right, winter is coming. I know I just swore. I'm sorry. <laughs> winter and snow. <laughs> Bad words. <laughs> mm. But we need to um, cover some of our windows because our windows are old and the, you know, the draft gets in, the wind sneaks in. So I think I got six of these. Yep. Yeah. Mm, two, three. Yep, yeah, six. So cover up the windows. So 25 each. Yeah, it looked like they were just putting like this kind of stuff out, so I grabbed them. Alright, this was the last one, and I grabbed it. It was $4. Batter dispenser for like if I do pancakes or muffins, you know, or cupcakes, you know, it just makes it easy. I won't make a big mess, <laughs> especially when doing cupcakes. Yeah, that was $4. Okay. Alright, and I'm not sure how much this this was. I've never seen it at our Dollarama before. And the only thing I couldn't find that I need at Dollarama were the dryer balls. Um, the wool dryer balls. I swear, when I need something, the Dollarama carries it. They don't have it. But when I don't need it, they have it. Um, cause I keep, I keep checking. They haven't had it for like a few weeks. Uh, cause I need to replace a couple because one is all full of blue lint from Casey's blanket. So I had to toss it. Uh, yes. <laughs> uh, oh yeah. Oh, $3. Oh, that's pretty good. Um, Pepto Bismol chewables. Um, you get 12 in here. So for $3, that's really good. I picked up two because I'm going to put it in the first aid kit. So one for at home and one for in the car because really you never know when you need this, right? I mean, it's good for nausea, heartburn, and digestion, upset stomach, diarrhea. <laughs> oh, yeah, so I forgot that was good. I've never seen it before. All right, bag number two. All right, so in this bag, <laughs> I have a couple of containers. Actually, I think I have three all together. Okay. Oh. Now, I have this one. These are gorgeous, and they have them in, I think, three other different prints. 
one print is like a marble print and another print is like it looks like it's wood i love the suitcase kind of leather print look um four dollars and they've had they've had this for a while and i never bought one because it's like well i probably don't need one but now i do because i'm starting to craft a little bit here and there and i need something to put my craft supplies in just a few items that i bought i could bought some today um actually maybe i'm gonna put my glue gun in here you know and it's really nice and it's just like the right enough it's i mean the big enough is a bit of that but oh my gosh you think i you know how many whole videos have i done you think i can do one nope nope <laughs> mm. real life okay um, it's big enough for what I need it for, so $4, and then I got this one, this one was also $4, um, I got this one to put our flashlights in for when the hydro goes out, um, a little emergency, you know, kit, and put that kind of stuff in it, flashlights, which I bought a Dollarama, I think, last time, I think it was, yeah, but totally forgot to buy, buy this, so. Yeah, alright, so that is that. And then I bought a small one. This was $3 to put our batteries in. I bought this before. Um, but, word of advice don't drop it. Because if you drop it, these break off. So I had to replace ours. Yeah. But I love it, it's a perfect size for our batteries. All right, um, glue gun mat, two dollars. So something like this will go in here. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let me see. Um, heavy duty clamps. These are mini ones, a dollar twenty-five. Okay, so I need them for crafting. Um, one of the things that I needed were wire cutters, so, and I don't know if the hubby has any, he might, but I'd rather have my own and I can put them with my own stuff, you know, so three fifty dollars for two wire cutters. And I had another word hunt book, because remember, if you watched my last haul video, um, I grabbed one of these. I think it was a different one, um, but it was, you know, the same one word hunt to go. And this is perfect if you have like a doctor's appointment, you know, you have to wait somewhere, you know, because, or like for a road trip, right? Because, you know, it's just, it's awesome. So I got one and I, I wanted to get another one because both my dad and my hubby do love doing this, but my hubby hasn't done it for a while. Um, but I think this will be, this will give us something to do. Um, but it's gonna be for Christmas for the stocking. This is a stocking stuffer, uh, but um, I think he will, you know, take it up again if he has it. I like I like doing these too. Who remembers? Well, you you can still you can still um, get it. Actually, my dad still does does it Saturday, the Saturday morning in the comics in the newspaper, and then they have the the crossword puzzle. My dad still does that one. But like when I was living back at home. <laughs> I would drive him nuts because like if I saw it lying around I would like start doing it too like I would like you know help him and he would notice <laughs> yeah um yeah so I got another one so now both the hubby and my dad will get one yeah <laughs> um just small twist ties $1.25 um treats for Lois $3 because I just opened up the last one in a cupboard so yeah um, outdoor lock for shed, two dollars. Oh, and um, craft magnet still are twenty five. I want to take that Beauty and the Beast picture that I got um, in my Poshmark package, and I want to make that into a magnet. And one of you guys, one of my subscribers and friends, said that, that dollar stores like they they sell magnets and the laminate. The laminated sheets, but I did not find the laminated sheets, but I found the magnet. So, one out of two, but I will keep my eye out for the magnet. Alright, and um, Halloween mask, reusable for the boys since we are heading into October. Um, I think they were $3.
because there was like no price and yeah nope sorry two dollars two dollars oh that's pretty good all right two dollars yeah there was no price on the hook <coughs> excuse me oh mm. no this built some can't take me anywhere all right shopping list notepad dollar 25 all right glue gun sticks Dollar twenty-five. Now, if you watch my Costco haul, um, you know we got. I uh, bought a gingerbread house for Halloween, so I picked up some candy to go with it. Um, these were two fifty. Eyeball, gummy candy. Oh, look at oh. <laughs> and I'm going to hide this. Um, this one was three fifty. Gummy bat. And then a bag of caramels, $2.50. Yeah, we probably won't use a whole bag, probably half of it. So I can always save the rest. Yeah. So I'm going to hide these because if I see the candy, they're going to eat it, especially the gummy candy. Um, but that is going to be for our our um, gingerbread house that we'll be doing next month. Woohoo! Yeah. Exciting. Um. Yes, they would really, really love that. It was kind of hard because, like, the Halloween candy it was like mostly like the mini miniature chocolate bars, and the other candy was um, um, suckers, lollipops, and because uh, I was trying to stick with Halloween candy, right? Because it's a Halloween haunt, not uh, not haunted house, um, <laughs> Halloween gingerbread house. Well, I guess it could be a haunted house, um, but. <laughs> That was like all I had, um, and they got me candy, and oh, they had the rockets, and we don't like the rockets. You, you guys in the states call them Smarties, but uh, yeah, they taste like chalk. <laughs> so I do, and it's one candy. I know there are some people that like them, but it is the one candy. If we go trick or treating and the boys get them, that is one candy that goes straight to the garbage because they don't eat them, we don't eat them. They're gross. They taste like like, like chalk. Yeah. <laughs> mhm. Mm yeah. So if I figure it out, that will do. That'll be good. Okay. So let me put this stuff away. Uh, I'm going to be filming a Dollar Tree haul right after this, but I knew I had to split it up in two because I just got too much stuff. I had fun. Yes. Uh, I I need to stay away from Dollar Tree and Dollar Tree. Yeah. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay. Right. So that is it for this Dollar Ramble haul. Um. Yeah, oh, and I spent, uh, let me see, what did I spend? Uh, $94.08. <laughs> That's usually what I spend around Christmas time. <laughs> but it's because it's like, I need the containers, you know, it's like, that's four bucks, and here's another three bucks, you know. I got up quick, yeah. Mmm, mmm. Did I tell you how much the work, uh, I don't think I did. It was three dollars, yeah. Yeah, okay. Let me deal with this poop and um so yeah the next video i'm going to be in the same shirt and that's why because i'm filming with these on, on the same day yeah so thanks for watching i really truly do really appreciate it make sure you give us a thumbs up leave a comment down below and if this is your first time watching one of my videos and you're not subscribed yet hit that subscribe button i'm happy to have you welcome you to my youtube family and we can have fun together and get into trouble um when i go to, when i go to dollarama okay yeah, because I'm always there. I can't stay away. Um, no, I can't. <laughs> there needs to be a Pacific Help Group just for Dollarama. I know, a Dollar Tree. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, so let me, I'm going to just do that. Put, oh, put stuff away. And yeah, Dollar Tree is next, so look for that. All right, thanks for watching and have a great day. Great morning, afternoon, evening, whenever you're watching us. Just have a, a fantastic day. All right, bye. Take care. Be blessed.